Good morning, guys. Um, today, I'm gonna keep it a bit of a surprise for the kids, but I think there's this really fun park that they like, and it has a bit of, a, it has like a small zip line for them to go on. Uh, we call it zip line park. Um, so I think I'm gonna surprise them and take them there today, um, just because it's a sunny day, and I've been telling them that we're gonna go to the park, and we never have, or we haven't yet, just because of, we either have friends coming over or something along those lines. So, yeah, that is what our plan is for today. It's going to be really fun. I have a bit of cleaning up to do in the kitchen because this is really messy. Um, but I also have to find out what the name of the park is because I can't remember. So I'm going to Google map it. And then, yeah, we'll leave sometime after lunch. Also, I should mention, uh, I, have a do or have a, I have an Instagram account uh, for my YouTube page. So if you, any of you guys have Instagram and want to go follow me, you can find me at Doozer Vlogs on Instagram. I'm going to throw in some laundry quickly because um, that's what I like to try and get done in the mornings. I try to do some chores um, before we leave to head out to go anywhere just because... Um, yeah, especially if the kids are playing good together. If they're playing good together, then I let them do their own things if they're not getting into anything. And then um, I normally clean up a little bit and then give the lunch and then we head out somewhere that's generally how I routine things. And they're usually pretty good, depending on the day. Guys, I'm gonna give you a little bit of cooking advice, okay? If you wanna boil water super duper fast, what you do is you actually turn on the opposite element to where your water is. It just, it makes it go so, <laughs> makes it boil so much faster, you just wouldn't believe. I do this like daily. Every single time I get on the stove, I turn on the wrong element. I'll be looking at like the right one, like I'll be looking at this one, cause that turns on the actual one. And then my hand will like gravitate to the wrong one. It's like uh, so weird and bizarre. Which every single piece. It's gonna be the most cheesiest thing you've ever used in your entire life since yesterday. Get ready. Here we go again, guys. The ultimate grilled cheese. Oh yeah, it wasn't as stringy as last day. No, oh, still lots of cheese on it. And he did take a really quick bite. So We'll, we'll, we'll go with that. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, I crushed it. Squirt, 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 squirt. Laminate squirt. And it's delicious. It's very refreshing on summer days like today the kids have been entertaining themselves uh, really good today so I've been managing to catch up on a lot of your guys vlogs um, which is oh, awesome because I've just it's so crazy having two little ones and trying to watch um, the vlogs as much as I would like to it's just it's really 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 busy and then at the end of the day, I am completely exhausted. So, um, yeah, so I'm trying to use uh, my little freedom time to uh, catch up on many of your, as many vlogs as I can. Um, and then I'm hoping to do the rest tonight, uh, just because, yeah, I haven't been doing a very good job about that. And I really apologize, I do, because you guys have been great with commenting on my vlogs, uh, most of you, so. Yeah, it's uh, so yeah, thank you to those who do comment, and I will be getting caught up on your videos. I promise it's just a matter of finding time, and finding time's difficult with these two crazies. Yeah, I'm drinking my water. Oh, and I'm washing my feet. Hmm, yucky water. Oh, my point exactly with those crazies. <laughs> One's drinking out of a toy cupcake kitchen set thing and another one is washing his feet in the sink guys I almost gave myself heart failure this morning I was uh <laughs> I uh, opened up my window and I slid it from back here 
from sorry from back there I pushed it from that side anyways and I was looking at some, I was grabbing something else at the same time and I pulled my hand and I hit the wing like hard like I went like mm, completely by accident I almost freaking pooped my pants it was very it was an intense five seconds left. it's gonna go right underneath Lizzie So we have successfully made it to Zipline Park, also known as Taylor Park, because I know a couple of you guys are from Vancouver if you haven't been here yet. Um, the zipline is down a bit further, we have to take a trail and walk down that way. Uh, but the kids just stopped quickly because there's a school across the road and then the playground for the school is over here. It's an interesting layout. Whoa! And Jack and Lizzie found an airplane that they can both fit on which means there's no fights. Bonus for me. There's also a bunch of this stuff everywhere. I don't I think it's pollen, but I'm not too sure. Oh, that little white fluff. So is that pollen? Is that what that is? My face is getting itchy, so that would be the only thing that makes sense in my mind. Um, but yeah, it's like floating like everywhere. If you look closely, you can see like little fluffs of it just like floating around. Here is the piece of the resistance or what that means. Here's the zip line. Um, it's just a very little, little, little one. It's nothing too spectacular. Jack, the professional zip liner, he is going to be taking off in three, two, one, blast. Ooh, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. Okay, don't push anything. Okay, this time around we got Elizabeth, the princess, about to go down from her castle. Here we go. Three. Are you ready, Lizzie? I'm ready. Look, look at the camera. Are you ready? Yeah. Here we go. Whoa. Man, guys, the zip line feels so much faster when you're on it. Yeah. Compared to what it looks like in video. <laughs> like, I mean, it's not like, holy crap, that's fast. But it feels like way more faster when you're sitting on it than it does when you're watching oh, the video. Okay, here we go. Elizabeth, take two. Here we go. Wow! Oh, bounce! Wow! <laughs> Oh, it's windy. Okay, so the kids and I, I'm kind of walking backwards because it's windy. The kids and I are gonna go on a hunt for some treasure. We haven't been to this side of the park before, like the side behind me. So yeah, we're gonna go on a hunt and see what we can find. I found treasure. Oh, and Lizzie's gonna be peeking. And we'll be able to watch the sky train. Look at, we're going over the highway. Oh, Jack already found a piece of treasure. It's a leafy treasure. Jack, ready? We have to jump when the cars come. Ready? Three, two, one. Jump three times. One, oh, two, oh, three. Oh. One more. Oh. oh no, we have two. One, two. Oh. That was tricky. Did you guys ever play that game when you were younger? You would stand on, maybe this is just me. <laughs> you would stand on top of the bridge and then jump as the cars were going underneath the bridge. Okay, you got two. One, two. Oh. That was a close one. Okay, Lizzie, get ready. Here comes the car. Jump, 
Or maybe I never used to play this game. It was just like a spontaneous thing that I came up with. Okay, that's it for the cars. But for some reason, I remember playing that when I was a kid. I don't know. Oh, here comes one more. This one's a truck, so we're gonna have to jump extra high. Ready? Jump! Woo! Oh, close one. Okay, let's go. Okay, here I'll let you guys take this jump. Jump! Wow, good job. Daddy, Found some old train tracks. I think we're getting closer to the treasure, me hearties. Wait, this is magic. Can I have it, please? Please. Okay, here, let's stay on the path and follow the train tracks. I love following abandoned tra train tracks. Lizzie, this way. Can I go, can I have to go another, can I just play some more play here? Yep. See, I prefer going on walks like these with the kids rather than going to a playground. I just, I love doing stuff like this than just going to a playground and sitting and watching them play. Because this is what I did when I was younger, right? Or what we did when I was younger. Um, was, you know, no, don't throw rocks. Yeah, you, you, like, you never stayed inside or stuff like that. I mean, back then you could go inside whenever you wanted to and you didn't have to worry about anything or anyone most of the time. But, yeah, this is like, this is my type of thing to do, is to go on little hikes and walks with the kids. So I think that's my favorite. I'm gonna go back. Here, just wait. Do you live that mountain? I live on that mountain. No, I don't live on that mountain. I live with you. So the kids and I have been searching for the train tracks and we kind of lost them for a minute, but I think we found them. The very old train tracks of the train that used to travel a long, long time ago. So we made it back from the, the park. Kids are very tired and very dirty. So yeah, it's a sign that my job has been complete for the day. <laughs> Gonna finish cleaning up my, uh, the kitchen, gotta switch the dishes out, and then I gotta fold my laundry, and then I gotta put my other laundry into the dryer, and then uh, I think uh, my chores are done for the day. Today has been a very successful day, unlike these past couple. Okay guys, I am heading to bed. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's zip lining adventure. Um, it was really, really fun, and I think the kids enjoyed it, so I hope you guys did too. Anyways, if you're new to my channel, click that subscribe button. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share it. And yeah, happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Hope you guys had a great day like you deserve. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys. Have a great night. I'm out.